Howdy folks and welcome to this reaction of Battlefield 5 official fire, Firestorm reveal trailer, the Battle Royale mode. Uh, I like how they had to put in parentheses Battle Royale so that people searching for Battle Royale would find it. Um, I am, I think I've mentioned this before in some of the Battlefield trailers, but if you're new to this, this channel, big Battlefield fanboy, used to be a big Call of Duty fanboy, um, and Call of Duty 4 Modern Warfare is, in my opinion, the best of that series. I love that game. I played the heck out of that game. Uh, after what Activision did to Infinity Ward, I kind of said, screw this. And uh, and I don't regret that decision uh, of really not becoming, a, not staying as a Call of Duty fanboy and buying all the games because uh, I have played a few of the games here and there afterwards and they're all pretty much the same. It's just nothing changes. And at least Battlefield is trying to innovate uh, for the longest time. Call of Duty. Anyway, I don't know why I'm getting into Call of Duty Battlefield War. Stop it. I don't want to be in a Call of Duty Battlefield War. I just personally... I'm a Battlefield fanboy. I've been a Battlefield... I keep saying fanboy. I've been a Battlefield gamer. A, a dedicated game, Battlefield gamer since... Uh, um, I mean, I played the heck out of it 1942 when it first came out. Uh, not in 1942. Battlefield 1942. <laughs> um, so I've been playing it all along. It's just that my preferred game was Call of Duty until that switch. And now it's pretty much been Battlefield. And... Uh, Ah, uh, I've tried the Battle Royale stuff uh, here and there. I, to be quite honest with you, I love single-player Battlefield. I love fun, uh, casual gaming of Battlefield with my friends. Uh, online multiplayer. And occasionally I'll dive in if I'm really bored or something. I'll dive in uh, by myself in the multiplayer uh, without any friends and just you know try to level up particular uh, classes or something. Um. So this is this is going to be interesting for me because I love Battlefield, but I'm not a huge Battle Royale player. But I'm still curious to see what Battlefield will do with Battle Royale that's different. Because I've I've toyed around with PUBG, I've toyed around with Fortnite uh, and some others, um, even even before Fortnite. Um, I'm kind of curious what they'll do differently. So let's uh, let's take a look at this trailer. Okay. They're shooting out of a plane, which makes total sense, right? Okay. So this is a four-man squad here. I think I've heard that they'll do solos, duos, and four-man squads. Uh-oh, another four-man squad. <laughs> Get some guns! So you do... <laughs> oh, that's cool. A flare. Oh, a flare for a strike, of course. Duh. Oh, that's funny. I was thinking uh, GTA for a second. Flare, huh? -huh. A oh, a tractor <laughs> pulling a, a cannon. Oh my god, yes! Oh, this is the Firestorm. They say instead of like a ring of death that comes in, it's going to be... How many people can get on that little early helicopter? And yes, there were early helicopters in World War II. They're not uh, They're not being crazy. I guess they can hold the whole squad, which makes sense. Burning down the house, that was it. the song just lyrics just said. Oh no! Yeah. Oh, look at that! Boat cars. Very cool. It is still Battlefield. Destructible environments. It is still Battlefield. Yeah, that fire, man. That ring of fire coming in. There's no grace with this one. Every other Battle Royale I played. Oh, crap. Oh, no, there is Grace. Okay. That's good that they showed that. You just basically catch on fire and you have to run to get through. Okay, I thought when it came through, it immediately killed you, but no. Oh, he got through on fire. <laughs> Saving his friend. Oh, that is so... That's epic! Come on, Battlefield is so freaking epic. What do we got here? Train tracks. Somebody's opening up. A tank. They're getting access to a tank. Oh boy. So those are going to be kind of secretive. Not secretive, but uh, rarer things. All right. Coming back here to the beginning, parachuting in. I think we talked about it. I think we covered everything. I don't think there was anything really unusual here. Uh, solos, duos, four man squads. I imagine I'll be doing some four man squad stuff with my buddies. Uh, maybe some duo stuff. 
uh, and probably would occasionally go in solo just to see, you know, what I can and can't do. I love that. My first reaction for some stupid reason was GTA V, you know, the comedy of it. I thought, and it was kind of comical. You know, these guys have all these guns just open up and these guys just fire a flare. And I thought, oh, that's funny. They only got a flare gun. Forgot that that calls in my artillery strike. <laughs> so basically they had the better, uh, better weapon. Oh, and the tractor. Oh, the fact that you, there's so many. That's what I love about Battlefield 2. So many vehicles. Now, obviously other ones like um, Battlefield, uh, Player Unknown's Battleground, PUBG. Uh, has vehicles, you know, so it's not it's not anything kind of new, and and even um, uh, the new Call of Duty one has has, uh, has vehicles. Um, but Battlefield's really kind of been known for that, you know. Call of Duty never really had drivable vehicles for the longest time until fairly recently, and Battlefield's always had them, uh, which I I love. My my son is a gamer too, uh, doesn't like that. He 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 prefers the foot soldier stuff. Doesn't really like vehicles. They kind of annoy him. So I know there's some people that don't like vehicles, but if you're watching this trailer, you probably are a Battlefield fan, so you probably like them. Um, I love the early helicopter, and you know, like I said, um, I'm kind of a history buff myself, amateur historian, amateur military historian, and uh, they did have early helicopters in World War II. I don't know if they had that particular model. I don't know what that model is, but they did have some very early ones. They weren't very powerful. They couldn't carry much, um, but they did exist, and, and kind of like with all new aviation uh, innovations they were used mostly for like reconnaissance and just you know, quick, quick, you know, moving somebody from one place to another. Uh, some messages and that sort of thing, uh, more than anything else. Um, I think they experimented a bit in World War II with uh, with extracting wounded soldiers, but uh, they they just weren't that powerful at that point in time. It was Korea where they really picked up uh, and started being used. Uh, like if you've ever watched Mash, the TV show. That's where they really started being used. But they did exist, so it's not an anachronism. It's not out of place. I think that's kind of cool. I love the fact that that you can survive behind the firestorm. I was concerned about that. Um, I thought, because all the footage I've seen before, just little snippets here and there, uh, with the fire ring coming in, everything was just being destroyed. Buildings were crumbling and everything. I'm like, oh, okay, well, if, you, if you're in the face of that, you're dead. Uh, there's no grace, but there is grace. They they act clearly well demonstrated that here with this guy being the sniper being trapped behind, uh, seemingly a little smoldering. He gets out uh, in time to you know runs out of the fire in time to save seemingly save his uh, squad mate who was about to go melee with somebody with a gun. <laughs> uh, so he manages to uh, to save him here. So um, this is cool. I can't wait to play this with my buds. I'm sure we're all going to be very excited about this. Uh, I know we're all very excited about this. Hope you guys are too. Um, let me know when you started playing Battlefield, if you are a Battlefield player, um, uh, what your favorite Battlefield is. My favorite Battlefield is probably Battlefield 4. Um, it really is. Uh, I, had, I, I, think it's, I think it's not because I think it's the best game. I think it's because I had the most fun with my friends during that particular period of time with Battlefield 4. Uh, we played, we were the most active at that point and that sort of thing. So I think that's why it was really a, a fond memory of mine. So it, it holds a special place and I really enjoyed it. Um, yeah. So let me know, guys. Thanks for watching. I'll catch you next time. Bye-bye.